Hello and welcome. Today I want to talk more about ghost links and how to clean up your models. So ghost links are some sort of links left over from deleted documents in CATIA. It can be part, assembly, drawing and so on. So they can corrupt your documents and can slow performance such as reading, writing and updating. Uh, because of that some companies don't want to have them in models. One of them is uh, Fawe and they have tools for cleaning, cleaning up these uh, ghost links like Wallat and Kadua and th these tools uh, can help you a lot to clean ghost links but in most cases they are not enough. I have a lot of problems with these ghost links because I didn't know how to clean, clean up the models and at the end I find a solution. I call it elimination method and it works like this uh, when you have your model you want to delete for example I have here two main assemblies and in every main assemblies I have these sub assemblies inside of those sub assemblies I have parts so the biggest problem in in model for ghost links is uh, to find where is that ghost link in which part it is it can be in also it can be in more parts so before uh, you want to fix it you need to find that uh, a part with ghost link so now I will show you how this elimination method works and how to find this part in model so now I will create some basic uh, link I will go here to test one I go to access system and I, and I will publicate this absolute access system publication and I will copy this uh, absolute access system in for example in this sub assembly 4 in test 7 pay special as a result with link this is common procedure when you want to copy something with link you need to publicate and copy with link so now I will save this model save all and I will close it I have here location of my model and before you want to start with this you need to make a RAR from this uh, model because you will destroy this model okay I make RAR now I will go back or one second I will it's okay okay no and I will open this I will change here before I open this assembly I will change name for this test one here test one maybe now I will make this uh, RAR again uh, and now I will open this model and you will get this message uh, following this could not be found you need to find this part this is most easiest way to fix ghost links when you have this message so you know that is something is wrong you just need to go to desk and you can go here and find find this part and replace it's very easy but in most cases you will not have this message and you just when you go here to send to directory you will just have this ghost link and you will not know where is where is that ghost link so you will need to find in model now let's start with elimination method I will eliminate this assembly too so what I want to do with this is when I delete this assembly I want to check again uh, for ghost link if it is uh, if it is in model I know that uh, ghost link is not in this assembly too or in any in any of these parts it's very simple you can also delete part by part but it's very slow so I will delete uh, full assembly so delete and then save save all and I will check now in in here so still a uh, ghost link so now I know that the ghost link is not in it, sub assembly uh, 2 and now I will delete for example this sub assembly uh, sub assembly 2 so I will define here and delete file save all 
and then check again. Uh, still, I still have this uh, ghost link. So now I know that that the ghost link is not in this uh, uh, sub assembly two. It is in this sub assembly one. So inside of this sub assembly one, I have only two parts. But in your case, you have you can have more parts. I don't know tw twenty or more, and you can delete, uh, for example, five at once and then go to send to and check and then uh, if, if it is in those parts you can uh, for example uh, I can make one I will make new part now here to show you what I mean for example part 2 uh, part 2 and maybe one more part part 3 okay and I will just add them to the model for example in this sub assembly and part 2 also in this sub assembly and I will save save all save okay and now uh, for example I will reorder this uh, test tool so like this I'm sorry test one and okay so I'll for example I will delete these three parts at once if I delete them send to directory I need to save first save all and then send to and as you can see there is no uh, ghost link but uh, I don't know in which of those parts it is but you can uh, take them back and then again check in this case I don't have uh, that empty part and I will stop here but I hope so that you understand how this uh, works uh, I, will, I will show you a again but really quick so now I will delete this model one and I will uh, for example extract here again and I will open this I have ghost link here I will I will delete this yes test one it's okay and I will just go so now everything is fine I don't have any ghost links in this model and now for example I want to copy this absolute axis system in for example um, let's say or, or I will copy from from let's say test 8 this axis system I will copy tools and to publicate I will copy this for example in this uh, here test 5 Pay special and now I will change the name for this test date so I will save this so test 8 I will change the name and I open this model again so save message again so now um, for example I will start uh, with this assembly again I will delete this assembly so delete delete all children okay and then save all file send to as you can see I don't have ghost link so I know that ghost link is assembly 2 so not in this assembly here now I will just um, take back that assembly 2 uh, one moment please uh, this new so now I will uh, add again this AC2 open, open and as you can see you have ghost link again so now I don't know in which of these sub assemblies is those is that ghost link so I will delete for example this first sub assembly delete and save again and again uh, send to, to directory 
as you, as you can see I have still this ghost link so now I know that this ghost link is in this sub assembly but I don't know in which of those parts and now you can just check in which of those parts I hope so that this uh, method will help you a lot because these ghost links uh, can be very big problem in models thanks for watching